You get to the gate, you get to the gate of the airport, there's those smug fuckers at the gate, you know, the speedy boarders, you know them fuckers that are paid extra to be fast-tracked up the front. You can see them standing there going, think you'll find I'm first. <laughs> Tosser. <laughs> you know, he's going for his pre-flight checks, you know, Polonek, check. <laughs> Corduroy trousers, check. <laughs> really small penis, check. <laughs> He thinks he's going to get on the plane first. I don't think so. <laughs> you know when that EasyJet woman starts speaking into that microphone, you know, speedy boarders and passengers with children only, please. When that comes out the speakers, <laughs> that's translated into, Ready! <laughs> Bando! <laughs> Everyone's like, Aah! seeing the faces of those speedy boarders when they realise they paid extra to be fast-tracked onto a fucking bus. <laughs> you get to your plane, you know, you walk up the steps, and there to greet you at the door is... Oh, Orange Face Phyllis. <laughs> Cos you know everyone that works for EasyJet's fucking orange. <laughs> and the trouble with EasyJet is everything's orange. <laughs> so all the staff keep merging into the background. <laughs> You're getting on the plane and hovering in front of you is like a hairdo with some teeth. <laughs> Welcome to Easy Jet! Fucking <laughs> hell! And have you tried the seats on these cheap airlines? Have you tried the seats? The captain comes over the tannoy and he goes, ah, once we're in the air, you'll be able to kick back and relax. Yeah, yeah. Have you tried pressing that little button in your armrest? Have you tried pressing that? Fucking, that's it, that's it, that's all you get, that's it. <laughs> Kick back and fucking relax. <laughs> What's this Hobbit fucking airlines? Because <laughs> they always say that, then they, when you're coming into land or you're going to crash, put your seat in the upright position. What? 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 That's going to save my fucking life, is it? <laughs> Not only is this a shit amount of room, but now you're one inch closer to the ground, the very thing that's going to fucking kill me! <laughs> In fact, you've got to crash to get more leg room. It's on the... <laughs> oh, now that is what I call luxury. <laughs> what do you reckon, love? Love? Where the fuck she... <laughs> well, she won't be needing that then, will she? <laughs> <laughs> then you get them fuckers, you know, the latecomers who turn up on the plane late, start trying to get their bag in the overhead locker. Oh! <laughs> now you're sat there with some stranger's knob coming at you. <laughs> mm. I didn't know the in-flight entertainment was dodge the dong. They're going like, who are you? They've always got that huge bag that doesn't comply with handheld luggage regulations. He's still trying to squeeze it in there. Looks like he's trying to squeeze Anne Whitaker into a fucking bread bin. <laughs> and you're sat in your seat. You've got a five-hour journey. You're sitting there going, yeah, this is all right. I can sit here for five hours. It's quite comfortable, actually. And then suddenly that woman gets on the plane, sits in the seat in front of you with that kid that won't stop <laughs> fucking crying. <laughs> and the only thing that stops him is when he pokes his head over the seat in front of you and you go, boo. Then his mum's face appears in that little gap between the seats and she goes, Oh, I think you found a friend there! <laughs> no, I don't want a fucking friend! Because <laughs> you know what's going to happen now? She's going to have a fantastic journey and you're going to be Barney the purple fucking dinosaur. <laughs> you're still sitting there three hours late with that kid poking his head up like, <laughs> I fucking hate kids. <laughs> Four hours later, he's still doing it. You're looking at the door going, if that door opens, I'm fucking jumping out. 
after five hours of this, the kid pokes his head up over the seat in front of you and you go, Dare! <laughs> Everyone in the seats behind you is like, ah, fucking well done! <laughs> if you were gonna do it, I'd fucking was. 